was inside and you guys are coming to support us. We feel so, it was great feeling. We knew there are people outside fight for us. And that is one reason we had never also give up. So we should keep up the fight and get our freedom. Everyone should be free, like no one should be hungry. Uh, we are human beings, end of the day, and we should support each other and help each other in any way we can Aisha, afford. Aisha. Um, Aisha. Thank you. Uh, that's it. And I'm so happy to be here. Yeah, thank you very much for all of you. East Africa uh, <laughs> and I've been in England since 2004 but I was in Yalswood last year in August and uh, I was there for two weeks and I met Mebo. Mebo I've been with you I saw you every day and uh, so everyone thank you for coming Cambridge you're here London Liverpool everyone here when I look at you I see um, surrounded by people who are young who are fierce who are ready to act I can see the people who are determined for uh, you know progressive Britain I can see uh, the anger and the, the you know the power in you and I love, I love the fact that you're ready to fight for us you are ready to fight to give us freedom you're ready to fight to give those people in behind those windows freedom because I have been behind those windows and I know how terrible it is. So to see many faces of you here who are, who are here today, I, I'm happy. I, I'm really pleased. So you might ask, why are we here? Why am I here? I am here to see uh, freedom given to people in detention centers. I am here to see equality given uh, to the people. And uh, we, the movement of justice, we are not, we are not, we will not be afraid to challenge the wrong and the dangerous policies. The policies where people are kept into detention centers for, you know, unlimited time. Uh, we we work collectively to, we work collectively to work to overcome the prejudice and ignorance surrounding the one who treats us like less human beings. We fight for the oppressed to see that they are given the equality and the freedom. We are here to see a Britain which is, which is more cultural and diverse. For those who have no idea, there are those people who don't recognize that this Britain is diverse and more cultural. I, I think they need their heads tested because we are here, people are here, people Amen. of different, you know, <laughs> fighting for a, a Britain which is united than divided. We are here because we are fighters. We are the people who refuse to entertain the ideology that it's only the rich and the poor who can make a difference in the society. Us also can make a difference in the society. Yes. We make this society. My ancestors make this society. They fought in the war. They, they are the people who are here in a long time ago, scrubbing the, the NHS floors, the hospitals, to make it a better place. Yes. So once they were here working to make it a better place, now, if people here in Britain, the immigration will see me and put me in detention centers, they don't want me here anymore. Well, well, I'm here to stay. <laughs> values of Britain. Britain was, is, uh, is a place where people can speak, they have the freedom of uh, speech, yes. there was freedom of education, but this is, you know, healthcare, but this is not the, 
the case anymore. Things have changed and uh, people are battling, you know, uh, they're, they're battling man-made disasters on a daily basis. We fight for freedom, dignity, respect. We fight for the equality and the justice. Uh, we want to see a secure progress Britain. Immigration thinks that people who are from countries, other countries like mine, like Uganda, that we are inferior. They treat us like they, you know, we don't deserve to be here, but hopefully uh, this will change. Because those people who are there, I sat with them, I interacted with them, I spoke with those women, and they've been, they run away from, you know, terrible, yeah, they've run away from terrible situations like FGM. I mean, who would, if somebody was going to attack you or attack your private parts, you will run away and you won't want to go back. You would do anything possible not to go back in the hands of somebody who wants to do something to you. So once you tell somebody, I am not going back, they think you're joking, but you're not joking, you're actually not going back because you're actually afraid. So um, I will say to people who are inside Yeltswood, hello everybody in Yeltswood! Yeah. <laughs>